Good morning, Langley Leopards. Happy Fun Friday. So today on Fun Friday, we're going to learn a couple art vocabulary words and make a fun art project. So today we are going to do a sun and moon picture. And so um, those are opposites and opposites are when something is completely different. Night, day, light, dark, up, down. So we're going to do an opposite picture today and we're also going to talk about colors that can be opposites. So you have the warm colors and the cool colors. The warm colors are red, orange, and yellow and they are colors that can um, show your feelings of like anger or frustration. So these are your warm colors and when you think about these warm colors I want you to think about the fiery hot sun. Now, I want you to think about the cool colors, like the cool, crisp night, or um, the cool um, water. So, the cool colors are your greens, blues, and purples. All right? So, the first thing you're going to do to make your night and day, sun and moon, opposite, warm and cool color picture today, I want you to draw a diagonal line. And we talked about diagonal. I used to teach my second graders the diagonal dab. Okay, so corner to corner. So you're going to take your pencil and you don't have to make a straight line if you don't want to. I'm going to make mine wavy so I don't have to worry about it being perfect. All right, and then it doesn't matter. Um, I'm gonna start here, and I'm gonna start with my warm colors for my sun. So let me write this down so we can see. And I'm gonna make my sun this time right in the middle with a big circle. I'm doing it orange so you can see it. And then I think for my lines, when I think about anger or frustration, I think about zigzag, these sharp, pointy lines. So I'm going to do a lot of these pointy, fiery, hot sun lines all the way out. So sometimes you can use art to express yourself. And if you're in a good mood, you might want to use those cool colors. But if you're in a kind of really sad mood or mad mood, you can use those warm colors. Mrs. Jones is usually always happy. So I use a lot of those cool colors, those calming colors. Alright, and then for this one, I'm going to do a big yellow to fill up that space. Alright, now I don't want to leave my sun plain, so I think on the inside, I'm going to do little triangles. More like a pointy line on the inside, and then maybe I'll just fill it up with little lines. All right, so there's my fiery hot sun part, and now I have to do my moon part. So for my moon, I'm gonna make a crescent moon. Okay. And I said the cool colors for your blues and greens, so I actually have a um, lighter blue. And when I think of cool, calming lines, I think of some wavy lines and some smooth, not so pointy, jagged lines. So here's my wavy lines. And then I also think of swirls. So I'm going to do some swirls in my background. So today's Fun Friday picture is talking a little bit about the warm and cool colors and how you can express your emotions and feelings. Your cool colors can also express the emotion of sadness. So if you're a little sad right now that you can't see your friends and you can't go to school, maybe you can use some cool colors for your picture. 
But I always like to think of the cool colors as the calming colors to the relaxing colors. All right, so I would love to see your artwork posted today. So here's the one that I did with you guys, but here's the one that I did earlier. So my warm colors with my fiery hot sun and my cool colors with my moon. You could draw some pictures of things that make you maybe feel angry or some things that make you feel calm with some warm and cool colors too. I hope you guys have fun. Um, I had fun making art with you this week. I love you. I miss you. Have a great weekend and I'll see you Monday.